starting to lose the keenness off that blade, so I'm just going to brighten it up. So, just adjust this up. Take the blade out. Yeah, just losing that keenness. Now, when I sharpen, and I've shown people before on other videos on sharpening, I don't go like that with my arms. I actually rock my body. That way the angle of my arms and the blade and the stone remain the same. When you're flattening the back, that might not be as important. But when you're putting your secondary bevel on, if you go like this, in effect, you're doing that. I know it's exaggerated. And you can roll the cutting edge over. Whereas if you keep it in that plane, find your point where you want your secondary bevel and then rock your body, that will then stay in the same plane and you won't be rolling it over. So I find it. And the way I do it is you put your blade on the stone. And then when you rock it, when you actually find that secondary cutting edge, the stone just changes colour, just fractionally. And then it's a question, I'll give it a three. Check for a bevel on the burr on the back, a very slight one there. Same thing, rock your body. Then I do two. Find that edge. One. Two. Very fine burr. Take that off. And I do a one. Again, very, very fine burr. Knock that off. And if you've got a flat strop, give it a couple of licks. Now once we've got it sharp, it's just a question of fitting it back in the plane. Now setting these is quite easy. Just get a nice flat piece of timber. It doesn't have to be quite as decorative as this piece. Pop it down, put your plane on the timber, bevel down, just let the weight of the blade go in there. I, I give it a little bit of a backwards and forwards just to centre it and then push it forward which it brings it back, brings the iron back onto the bed of the plane. Get your wedge, give it a bit of a tap. And that's got a little bit too much coming out. That's going to be too aggressive. So you just, with your hammer, sight down the sole of the plane, give it a couple of little taps on the back, knock the wedge in. Put your job back in. And away we go again. Okay, that's a little bit fine. Little tap, tap on the wedge. See the difference? You can hear the difference. Get nice full width shavings. And it's cutting through very nicely. <laughs> 